المواطن محمد لطيف حسين من دولة العراق محافظة الأنبار عندي ابن أخي كان تعبان بسبب السحاية بالعراق وعلاج ماكو يعني ف بعد معاناة طويلة رجعنا للدكتور على مود السمع ماله فقال من عنده إذان اليسرى ما تسمع وإذان اليمنى تسمع سبعين بالمئة فسوينا الفحوصات والإجراءات كاملة أخذنا له سماعة خارجية سعرها ستمائة دولار وظلينا بعد تقريبا سنة أكثر من سنة قام يشيل السماعة ويذبها يعني ما فادتها بأي شيء فدزينا التقارير الولد هنا خوينا اسمه طارق فعرضنا على الدكتور بالمستشفى Bilal came to us with the complaints of speech and hearing impairment since the age of one year. On inquiry and discussion with the family, we came to know that he had brain fever at the age of one year. Subsequent to that, he lost the capacity to hear and along with that, his capacity for speech also could not develop. So, when we came to the seventh year of the hospital, the doctor was given to the doctor. The doctor saw the التحاليل مالته اخذنا له التحاليل كامله يعني مكمله بعد التحاليل يعني مش كم يوم يعني مو هوايه فطمنا يعني بنسبه النجاح العمليه يعني ممتازه ان شاء الله حيل ونسبه النجاح العمليه كلش عاليه فطمنينا احنا وطمنينا يعني حتى اهلنا بالعراق يعني اطمئنهم يعني حيل بشده يعني والحمد لله سوينا العمليه والعمليه نجحت تمام وفضل الله يعني هذا ما ينسي the child also was sent for assessment by a pediatric neuropsychologist to rule out important things like autism and congenital intelligence disorders and we decided to implant him with a nucleus uh, cochlear implant which was the right one for his age and his uh, condition. This surgery was done under general anesthesia and it was uh, a two to three hour long procedure. After that, the child is kept in observation for one day and after 24 hours, he was completely normal and he recovered well from the surgery. After the procedure, we saw that Bilal was very good. He was different in the days of the rest. He was a good one, but he didn't hear him. After the procedure, God bless him. He was a good one. ونصيحه يعني اكثر من مره بلال بلال ينتبه او نضرب له على الحاجه ينتبه يعني الفضل الله كانه ما طفل يعني هسه ولدنا جديد. Now the child is very happy is able to hear but the issue is there he cannot talk because he's the from the birth he couldn't hear so this is the second step for him he has to do some therapy to how to talk how to respond the voice or then to hear and then he can respond. Now, the therapy is going on for that. We did some course here in India, in Bangalore, in Manipal Hospital, right with. So we can continue there in Iraq for how to talk, how to respond, how to do the act. Right now, he has recovered very well, and his acceptance of the implant is very good. Usually, the children who have been in you know, complete silence, they suddenly become aware of the sounds, and they get afraid, and they start rejecting the implant. Whereas Bilal has been very, very you know, brave. He's been able to accept the implant as a part of his you know, body now. And he is reacting to sounds. He turns his head on sounds now. Right now, he just has started making you know, single sounds like ish, e, u, and all that. Now, Bilal's partners and all the, his family are very happy because we got good response, good benefit after the surgery. And just looking at Bilal, you, you feel happy because he's doing active. Uh, he responds, he hears. شعور بهذا المستشفى يعني مستشفى يعني كلش ممتازة وراقية. وأني أنصح العالم يعني اللي عندهم هيك حالة مثل شغلة بلال بزرع قوقعة أفضل يجون هذا المستشفى مستشفى باني بول يتلقى العلاج يعني وكأنه ما فلوسه ما راح بلقاه. يعني هو يعني كاسب الفلوس وكاسب يعني المريض ماله. فنصيحة يعني لله واحد يعني يجي لهذا المستشفى أفضل فبالنسبة للمستشفى المانيبال مستشفى راقية وممتازة 
والكادر ماله كلش ممتاز واضافه يعني الدكاتره يعني ناس حبابين ومثقفين وتفاهمون مع المريض يعني بكل وسائل الطرق